In my first year in university, I was told that we must read one of the Bibles of architecture, called Architecture, Form, Space, and Order. According to Francis Ching, the author of this book, architectural forms occur at the juncture between mass and space. Ching explains that as architects, we should be concerned with both the shape and the mass containing the space. This idea might sound complicated. However, this book points out that the main vocabulary of forms in architecture is quite simple and elementary. It all goes down into basic and simple ideas used to create the wonders that we all love. These elements are points, lines, and planes. A point is the prime element of forms construction. It can mark a position in space, define two ends of a line, the intersection between the lines, and the center of a field or plane. A line, on the other hand, can be thought of as a point in motion. It can also express direction, growth, or orientation. Consider a line as a segment of an infinitely longer path that can go to infinity. And finally, the plane is a transparent membrane structured between two parallel lines. Now that we know the three main elements, we can analyze and understand that all volumes consist of points or vertices where several planes come together, lines or edges where two planes meet, planes or surfaces which define the limits or boundaries of a volume. Volumes are the three-dimensional elements in the vocabulary of design. A volume can be either a solid space displaced by mass, such as a building that stands as an object in the landscape, or it can be a void enclosed by planes. However, Ching wants us to understand that in creating spaces, we should not only be concerned with form, but also with its impact on what it is around, such as the light that radiates energy and reveals the shape, colors, and textures. All are topics for another video. We are publishing educational videos on architecture on a regular basis. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel.